and welcome into our roundtable discussion. We're talking everything winter weather related. I'm meteorologist Jacqueline Woodall and joining me is senior climatologist Dave Phillips from Environment and Climate Change Canada. Welcome. Thank you, Jacqueline. As well as our chief meteorologist, of course, Chris Scott with the Weather Network. So we want to talk about winter weather, the season as a whole, and really where the season uh, can go in the future. So we're talking about climate change. So the big question is, you know, people say warm winter, cold winter, it's all climate change related. Are winters changing or are winter storms changing? Well, uh, clearly we know all seasons in Canada are warmer than they used to be, but particularly winter. Right. I mean, we're known as the winter people, uh, the great white north. I don't think we're as, I think we're still great, we're maybe not as white as we used to be, but certainly from a temperature point of view, if you stick a thermometer into Canada, in my lifetime, say 70 years, uh, temperatures have gone up by about three and a half degrees. I mean, that's a, that's a huge difference. And in some parts of Canada, it's even more, been more dramatic than that. In the Northwest, in uh, uh, Yukon, Northern British Columbia, the Prairies, the Mackenzie, it's warmed up by five to almost six degrees. And certainly in the last little while, my gosh, in the last 20 years, I would say that we've had maybe one of those winters. Uh, 2014 was colder than normal by half a degree. Two were normal and 17 were warmer than normal. So clearly, there's no doubt about it, that our winters aren't what they used to be. And while the statistics don't lie, the challenge with communicating this is that people don't experience this climate. We, we don't experience 30 years. We experience today and this season. And leading up to that polar vortex winter of 2013, 2014, I didn't think we'd ever see a winter like what we talked about back in the 70s. But we did. We saw it. And I think that's the challenge is people go through these harsh periods of winter weather and think, well, this can't be climate change right. because it's not warm. But climate change, it's just skewing things. It's meaning that we're moving the goalposts so that we see more warm winters. It doesn't mean we can't still get these ferocious storms or these periods of intense winter weather. And you, you asked about storms. Too. Yeah, I did. Jacqueline, I, I think that, you know, the, the evidence is not there necessarily that our storms, you know, have changed dramatically. But I think they're different in, in a couple of ways. One is the statistics of storms are different. You know, the fact that they may be more intense, they may be lasting longer. We're getting those same old storms, but they seem to be maybe bigger out of season. And I think the other thing though that truly has changed, hey, we know the weather has changed, but we have changed, you and I. And so those storms are much more impactful now than they were when our, our parents or our grandparents were, were talking about weather. I think that's very well said. All right, stay with the Weather Network for all of your winter forecast details. We'll have it all.